Welcome to the video presentation for the Ecodome MCE Solar Energy Monitor. The MCE Energy Monitor is a very useful device for both photovoltaic or wind power generation systems. The monitor shows real-time production data for your PV system and general electrical consumption levels. The two inductive transmitter monitors are used to monitor production and consumption levels. We will see in a moment how to connect the transmitters. All the measured values are transmitted to the monitor and are visible on the display. The display shows the time and the date. And these three symbols, the house, the sun and the letter omega, which refer respectively to consumption, production and balance. The monitor can be configured for three-phase systems, as you can see on each transmitter there are two additional holes to accommodate additional terminals. Then proceed with the desired combination of transmitters. Remove the clear tab on the back. Press the code buttons for three seconds. When the keys begin to flash, press the button with the little house symbol. Then press the pairing button on the front of the transmitter with a paper clip for five or six seconds. During pairing, the transmitter light flashes and when the consumption transmitter is successfully paired, the house symbol becomes fixed. Label the transmitter as the consumption meter to avoid any confusion later. We proceed in the same way for the production transmitter. Now follows the process for installing the power consumption transmitter for the MCE Solar inside the main distribution board. Remove the front panel switching off the power supply. Locate the live phase cable under the main switch, connect the clamp to this and put the clamp and surplus cable into the enclosure. Replace the front panel. Fix the transmitter in any appropriate position. Restore the mains power and now the transmitter is ready to send the data to the MCE solar monitor. Now we'll show how to connect the production transmitter to the inverter outlet. Open the distribution board enclosure, having first disconnected the power supply from both the mains and from the inverter. Locate the live phase coming from the inverter. Fix the transmitter in a convenient position. and place the surplus sensor cable inside the enclosure. Then connect the clamp around the live phase from the inverter. And reclose the enclosure. At this point, with the power restored, the production data are transmitted to the MCE solar screen. For example, in this setup, we currently have a consumption of about 560 watts and a production of about 1500 with energy available therefore of about 970 watts. After making the connections you can configure the monitor to suit your needs going into the menu uh, with the set button. It is then possible to connect the intelligent smart sockets or outlets to the monitor. These devices, when combined with the first three channels, are activated in sequence automatically when the value is sufficient to feed them.
The production and consumption data can also be controlled remotely through the Ecodome MCE portal. With this simple bridge, you can connect MCE Solar to the portal. Once logged into the portal, the installer has the ability to view the data for all the systems which have been installed, and individual users can also view their own data. The display screen allows you to see in detail all the energy parameters, the instantaneous power production and consumption, uh, both generally and individual items connected to smart sockets and smart switches. A more detailed view can also be accessed on a graphic display. For example, we can see a graph of the composite production, consumption and balance at any one time. In this graph we see the energy that we give to the network and the energy that is consumed in the property. We can see a graph of daily production and also a chart of production the previous day. We can also see the production of the previous 30 days. And also look at the consumption for the last 30 days. Another interesting feature is the monitor function that allows us to have a summary panel showing the reported data for a single device or for all devices. Thanks for your attention and happy monitoring.